Miracle is known huh? as the kingdom of beauty, so much so that just walking on the street is the way to meet beautiful women. Oh my god! The <laughs> pretty girls! Ah! <laughs> Sorry, are you alright? Fairy! <gasps> Sorry! Because you're so beautiful! Haha! <laughs> you are sweet! But if you don't get up quickly, you'll miss the chance to see the five most beautiful princesses of Miracle. To increase attachment to the masses, once a month, mm. the royal princesses will leave the palace to go to help people in difficult circumstances. <laughs> Their arrival is always <laughs> warmly welcomed by the people. They even created a poll to see which princess was the most popular. At the top is the Princess Cancer, who has a friendly, gentle appearance. She was always kind to everyone, without distinction of classes. The difference is not too big in the number of votes, is the third Princess Virgo, the goddess of beauty. If only in terms of beauty alone, it would be hard for anyone to surpass her. Or for those who love fragility, softness, will definitely love Pisces. She's just too shy to show up as much as her sisters. There is not also a small number of people who love Scorpio's cold personality. In particular, not only men, but mostly women. You have to be more careful. So handsome! At the bottom of the list is the second princess, Leo. Mm. What was Leo doing in the room? Leo is beautiful, strong, and kind. It's just... Ah, mm -hmm. uh, huh? it exploded! <coughs> It's just that she keeps having something, well, <coughs> weird. Huh? Father! Leo is the most motivated of the princesses. She spends most of her time studying and researching. Why are my efforts always unrecognized? I just want people to have a better life. Of course, the left hand is also the hand, the right hand is also the hand, the king loves all. My huh? king, Princess Leo was coming. Hmm? Leo, hasn't she been eating seriously lately? But in the position not the first, not the last, not to make trouble, not to talk anything, Leo is often forgotten. <clears throat> well, uh, I have something important to tell you. <laughs> Prince Ares of neighboring country's envoy is coming to seek a marriage alliance among you there will be a princess to be married off. <laughs> being married to a princess means renouncing your inheritance and not being able to return to your country. Besides, Ares, although a prince, is just a concubine's child. He's not respected by the others. So everyone can see that this is not a good position. Hey, you! Cancer! You are the eldest sister. Say something! I can listen to everything you say, Father, but only my marriage? I've always wanted the true love of my life, not the political love of my life. Haven't you always wanted to get married and become a mother? The opportunity has come! Father, Leo said it. Let Leo go. She's a big girl. She always wanted to travel the world. This place was made for Leo. More... <laughs> <laughs> That's what a girl who dances all the time and dresses and dancing only thinks about it! <laughs> the real battle between the sisters broke out. Still strong, Scorpio squeezing in the middle, separating the two from each other. Get off me, you little girl! Fighting all the time because of silly things. Don't you see you are so childish? Hey, you are small but so rude. Just only know and fight like a man all day long. That's right, there is no such thing sweet and soft in her personality. So instead of just two people fighting, now we have the princess battle of three princesses. Actually, this is a normal thing at the breakfast of the royal family. Huh? Mm. Only you are always gentle and docile. Unfortunately, you are born always weak, constantly sick. Father, I'm okay. <coughs> Pisces' sickly cough stopped all huh? the princesses. Despite the disagreements, all the time they argue, they still love each other very much. 
That's enough for today. Go back to your room and rest. That night, the king confided with the prime minister about his troubles. I know it was a difficult decision, but you yourself understand the danger of breaking the will of the empire, don't you, my king? I know, but if I trade the happiness of the children I love most in the world... Huh? The conversation was overheard by Cancer outside. Not wanting her father to bother much more, she decided to sacrifice her own happiness. <laughs> they thought they would be happy because she was in trouble and escaped from the situation. But when they heard Cancer's decision, mm. the sisters were not happy at all. Huh? Deep in their hearts, they weren't ready for the noisy family to lose their eldest sister. Mm. Only a few days after the announcement of the engagement, the tragedy took place. The king passed away suddenly. The air of mourning filled the country. Miyoko has no prince. The king has not decided on an heir. With this situation, I'm afraid, trouble is going to happen. Huh? In my kingdom, who has the first birth huh? is the king. The soul of our beloved king would be comforted if my wedding with cancer took place quicker. But isn't that too hasty? No, you must believe me. Moreover, after you become queen, I will remain in Miracle to be a bridegroom, and my father's side will surely help. <sighs> Doubtful of this urgency, Leo secretly investigates and discovers that Ares is not as nice as he seems. Oh, look how I caught two little rabbits. You! How dare you betray my sister! For heaven's sake, we're just talking about intimacy. If you like, you two can stay. We can all talk. You've crossed the line! With the help of the other two sisters, Leo and Virgo decide to expose the evil of Ares, preventing her sister from marrying. This was on the last day of breakfast, the day before the wedding. Father, if you were still here, tomorrow would be the day I get married. There will huh? be no wedding! The four princesses told Cancer all about huh? Ares' lies and evils, as well as huh? the evidence they had gathered. But if so, war is going to happen. Even if you marry him, the war will still happen. Huh? Don't you want our father to rest in peace in heaven? When father is alive, he always wants all of us to be united and happy. The wedding was annulled, and Ares returned angry, vowing to lead the army back for revenge. <laughs> it's not just a threat. The Empire used this pretext to assemble its army, preparing for the big war. <laughs> to save the country for the first time in their lives, huh? the five princesses unite <laughs> and make the most of their strengths. <laughs> Cancer, who had been good at everything, now took care of the army's food supply. Leo's intentions finally have the opportunity to make people admire when they become the most advanced weapons, increasing the strength of soldiers. <laughs> Thanks to his haste in customs, Virgo can now lead a sewing team to work tirelessly day and night, very quickly solving the problem of weather-resistant clothing. The younger princess, Pisces, was weak all day just reading books, timidly suddenly matured, forcefully wrote down plans and strategies in great detail. Even the prime minister nodded at her wisdom, as well as the strategy's potential for victory. However, such efforts are not enough to convince everyone. During the gathering of soldiers, the people expressed their doubts and distrust. Against the Empire? No way! Miracle was just a small country. Mm. Nothing we do can change the ending. That's right. After all, you are all weak and soft women. Huh? Their attitude was huh? changed by a very decisive action. Mm. Invaders is coming. Who cares about men and women? The future is unpredictable. If we easily give up before we start, we will not be able to do anything in this lifetime. At the same time, when the general who commanded the army this time was none other than Scorpio, the royal princess, the people were extremely emotional, sworn unanimously.
with the cooperation and consensus of the whole country, even before that, the Miracle Army was considered inferior in both quantity and strategic combat ability, and yet they continued to win big victories. Step by step, they repelled the invaders. Scorpio triumphantly returned to the castle under the greeting of glory like an earthquake. Princesses, we have a big problem. The country cannot afford to prolong the state of non-ownership. Who would be most deserving of the top spot? Did the princess take care of food, weapons, clothing, strategy, or was she the one to fight? Let Scorpio be the new queen. She has no fear of danger and went to the battlefield herself. No, without Pisces' great strategy, I wouldn't have made it back alive. I just say what the book says. You've worked all day and night to take care of food, weapons, and clothes. That really contributed a lot. You're right. Let the people decide. All five princesses were crowned as queens. Besides, the peace of the kingdom would not be possible without the efforts of everyone. With their personality and talents, they together help the country become prosperous and better. Once upon a time, in the land of Wonderland, there lived the beautiful Princess Viva, who possessed the magic of making flowers bloom and giving life to plants. As soon as Viva waved her hand, all plants and flowers would bloom and be fresh all day. <laughs> That's because when the princess was born, there was green magic flying from the sky to her cradle and bestowed this gift on her. Since then, Princess Viva got magical abilities. She usually spent time with the people taking care of trees and food, so Viva was considered a kingdom treasure. <laughs> One day, a dark, mysterious smoke appeared from her hand when Viva was about to use her power with a tiny sprout. What happened? Why does my magic give off a dark light and cause the sprout to wither? No, I have to try again to find the reason. After that, Viva rushed to the garden and tried the magic again, but the black smoke from her hand caused the trees to die. Unfortunately, the people who were working that day accidentally witnessed this scary scene and immediately spread the word to each other. Look at the princess's hand! It seems that the princess's magic is cursed! It proves that the princess's endowed power has disappeared! Even her magic hmm. now has caused disaster for our crops! Then the country is about to fall into a state of misery! Immediately, everyone reported this to the king and queen. They suggested that the princess be detained in order not to spread dark magic throughout the kingdom. Although the king and queen were heartbroken, they had to decide to lock Viva in the room temporarily. What to do now? If I am unable to regain magic like before, I will definitely be locked in the room forever. I have to find out the cause and solution as soon as possible. While Viva was confused, she saw a butterfly fly past the window and bring with it dark smoke. This dark smoke is very similar to the magic on my hand. So, if I follow this butterfly, I will be able to know why my power disappeared and where the smoke comes from. Butterfly, can you lead me to where the smoke comes from? <laughs> After that, Viva sneaked out of the palace and followed the direction of the butterfly, leading to a dim forest. While Viva was walking through the forest, she heard a low voice echoing nearby. Is there anybody there? Please help me! With a kind nature, Viva followed the echo of the cry and saw a girl lying in the pit. Miss, <gasps> hmm. please, please help me! 
Okay, I'll do my best. Hmm. Viva looked around again and used the vines <laughs> around to save the girl. <laughs> However, while Viva rescued Era, <laughs> the two didn't notice that there was a small light flashing when they touched each other's hands. Thank you so much for saving me! Nothing but... Who are you? Why are you in this dark and deserted place? I'm Ira, the unlucky girl who lives in a nearby village. As it turns out, Aira also received a spell when she was a young child. However, Aira's magic was considered a bad omen for the whole village. She caused a lot of trouble due to a lack of control whenever she was nervous or afraid of something. Even one day, Aira's power created dark smoke, causing the magical flames to grow more and more out of control. As a result, she was chased out of the village by the villagers and wandered into this forest when she saw the dark smoke like hers here. Looks like our magic is under the influence of this dark mm. smoke. Oh, you are right! So is our source of power related to each other? Although I don't know what's the secret of our strength, instead of standing here, let's go find the source of our strength and why these strange things happen. That makes sense. But aren't you afraid I'll bring you bad luck? No, never. <laughs> After that, they continued on their way to follow the instructions of the butterfly. During that time, the two girls confided in a lot of things and became closer and closer to each other. And then there were nights when it became cold and windy. Aira loved her friend, so she tried her magic to create fire for Viva. However, due to anxiety, Aira was once again unable to control her power, which caused problems for Viva. Sorry, I didn't mean to. It's okay, I'm fine. Besides, I find your power very interesting and useful. Really? No one ever said that to me. Everyone says I can only cause trouble. It's okay. It's probably just because you're always in a negative mood that there's a problem with controlling magic. So when we can neutralize this dark smoke, let's mm. practice together. <laughs> After resting, they continued on their way. And then they came to a haunted wooden house without knowing where all the smoke was coming out. While bewildered as to what happened, the two girls heard a sly call. Why are you standing there? Come here. Two pieces of my magic. Mm. Those who carry the power of life and death that I have been searching for all this time. Mm. Entering the house, they saw a witch warmly welcoming them with open arms. <laughs> you know us? Besides, why is this place spreading those dark smoke? Of course, since the magic you possess is mine. Before, I spent a lot of effort to practice these two types of magic to rule Wonderland. One type is life magic, which helps me to revive the dark forces, and the other has the ability to destroy all. However, when I was about to combine those powers, I encountered a fairy who interrupted, causing my magic to be scattered, and I was also sealed in this wooden house. It took me a long time to create this dark smoke to call the two sources of power back to my side. And now that you're here, give me back the magic now! It cannot be! Even if I had to keep the dark magic for the rest of my life, I can't let you have the power to harm innocent people in the kingdom. Era, let's go. But if I huh? still keep this magic, it will make mm -hmm. me even more unlucky and get rejected by others. Mm. It's not like that, Era. We'll help each other control magic. <gasps> what nonsense are you talking about? Once you enter here, you'll have to give me the magic whether you like it or not. After saying that, the witch immediately attacked Viva to take away the source of her power.
However, Eva still managed to resist and escape the witch's control. Just when the witch was about to continue to strike at Viva, Aira stood up to stop her. Please take my death magic and spare Viva. She won't be able to withstand the attack again. Don't do that, Aira. Our kingdom will be destroyed. Whoever comes first is fine, because I'll get both the sources of magic back anyway. <laughs> After that, the witch quickly caught Aira and sucked her power. Immediately, Aira flared up with magical flames around her. However, since Aira couldn't control her own magic, she was easily countered by the witch. Ha! Huh, you idiots dare to go against me? In your dream! The witch got angry, cast a spell, catching both Viva and Aira, and laughed happily. Besides, almost all of the power I've drawn from both of you here is enough for me to destroy this place! <laughs> Sorry for not being able to save you! It's okay. At least you tried your best and regained confidence in yourself to use magic to protect everyone. I'm so proud of you. Although we are in a weak position, I am sure both will still win if there is enough faith. Do you agree? Viva took Aira's hand and the two passed the last spells to each other in hopes of fighting to the end. And it was the faith, solidarity, and empathy of the two that helped them gain synergy, hmm. repelling the witch's attack. What happened? No! In the end, under the combined force of Viva and Aira, they won and caused the witch to hmm. disappear. <laughs> we nailed it! Finally, I have come to understand that each type of magic has its pros and cons. Just believe in yourself and try to think positively. Everything will get better. That's right, so let's unite together and discover more magic in the future. <laughs> Afterward, Viva happily embraced Aira in happiness and took her back to her kingdom. Since then, Viva and Aira had always helped everyone in the kingdom, and they became good friends forever. <gasps>